Hello guys, how's it going? Houdini here, welcome back to... They're back. Uh, yeah. We left, we last left off, um... I just see I found a bass, so just listen to that song, just amazing. <laughs> what a start. Can't get much of a better start than that. Might be cheesy to some people, but what a song. Just fits the mod pack, just perfect. Anyway, I'll jump into it anyway, and um, see where we left off. Yeah, I found a cave. Um, started build. I've started building out a little bit actually uh, before I started recording, so it's, it's kind of getting there. It's got a little bit of structure to it. Um, the noise you can hear is the metallurgic infuser, which converts certain things to. Well, the good certain things. Oh my god, what is that out there? Is that trying to fight me or what? Hey! I kill you. I think I saw that so I can get that. Well, then, thank you very much. Um, yeah, got a limonite sword, it's pretty cool. Uh, yeah, so I've, I've been using this to get a couple of things, um, as you can see in the bar. I've built a windmill, wind turbine, whichever one you want to call it. That will give me a little bit power so I can start building some more machines. Um, it's not that hard to use, eh, sorry, that, not that hard to build to be honest. Um, as long as you've got this bad boy right here. Basically what you need, I'll just show you, is actually osmium ingots, which is pretty easy to find if you can get some osmium. Um, or uh, you've got the enriched alloy which you use the metallurgic infuser for and it only uses iron and redstone so it's, it's fairly it's fairly easy to get and uh, what's these the basic control circuit is osmium and red redstone which gives you a controlled circuit so again fairly easy just as long as you've got the power and these two here is as you can see, fairly, fairly straightforward. It's not too hard to get. Again, um, the only snag I had was trying to figure out power. But obviously, this, this here, the heat generator, if you turn it around the right way, gives you enough power just to power that. It only takes. You can put about what 14 coils I've got there, and it'll fill nearly the halfway mark. So it gives you a bit power to, enough to power this anyway. But in using that, I've, in, well, I've gained some steel ingots, which you need to make basic cables, which is probably better because obviously you can't just really put your wind turbine in here to power that. So I think I'll put the wind turbines on this platform. I'll try and make this platform a little bit better. And then run, run, a, run cables through into here. So I can have like a wind turbine farm out here. I think it'll be pretty cool because it's quite high as well. I think the higher they are, the better they work, if I'm not mistaken. So, it's a little bit of a start there. Um, down here, screw down all the way down here, I've started another little room and I've built a DNA extractor. Now then, this is, was the cool thing. I only had six fossils, so I thought I'd put them in, see what I got. And as you can see, I've got five dino, di dino DNAs. I've got a Velociraptor. Oh my god, brutal or what? Quality is only 50%. I don't know if that's bad or I don't know how it works exactly, but we'll find out. I've got a Hypsilophodon. That might be a bird. I'm not sure. Maybe a sea creature. Um, a koala can. A coal acanth, whatever that is, I've got no idea. Um, I've got a herosaurus, which is 100% quality, and I know they're pretty vicious. So, and we've got a tylosaurus, which I believe is pretty vicious, but that's low quality. Again, I don't know what that means, but we'll figure that out in a little while once I start getting some power through. What I do know, what I do know, what I do need is some what was it it's coal i need some more steel dust 
make some ingots so I can get some more cable because I've only got eight and we don't go very far to be honest obviously one per block so we need a lot more than eight apart from that guys I've just gathered a few more of this loads of little bits of weak essence I don't know what the hell that is amethyst ingot limonite ingot I've got a few decent ingots um, along with yeah, that's, that's pretty much all I've got for now, to be honest. I was going to venture out because I want to try and find some sheep to make a bed, so then I can skip the night time and put no wool whatsoever. So I might I might actually do that now, um, seeing that I need some food as well, so I think it would be a good idea, to be honest. Um, I've got iron armour, I've got a pretty decent sword. I'll let that some more coal in there so we can get it. I'll let that run on its own. I'll put those in there. So we'll try and get some more of the rest of that coal in. Um, right, we'll venture out a little bit to see. Hopefully we don't die. Do you want to do? We'll be on the safe side. All my prized possessions are going straight into there. There's no way I'm losing these things. Um, swap that for those. Right, that'll do. Okay, let's venture out and see if we can find some sheep and not get killed. Normally, fat. Oh, there's a pig, so there's a good start. And some chickens, so that's a good start. Get get these, get some food. Sorry, Mr. Pig. Where you gone? There you go. Don't run away. There's beasties over there. I'll kill him, get some. Here, killing animals, but hey, go survive somehow. I'll kill you, get some chicken. Come here, chick chick. Sorry about that. That uh, oh, little pig. Oh, loads of pigs. Lovely. Sorry. Apologise. Sorry. Right. Bit of food for now. Lovely jubbly. Now we just need to find some bloody that doesn't look like what kind of tree is that? Oh you've got them weird birds as well. I hate them birds. I do hate them birds. I've got to face them at some point though. Let's see what happens with a limonite sword. Pretty, I'm fairly. Where's it gone? It just seems to have just disappeared. Oh well. Never mind. There's the creep around here somewhere. Maybe he's underground. I think he might be. Right, we're going to venture through these trees anyway. Those are a lot of men, I think. I think that's what they're called. If you right click on them, they've got some sort of. Um, yeah, so you've got silver coins. You can get a, a gem bag, gold coins, gold coins. But all I've got is copper coins, which is absolutely pants. Don't know how you trade them. You look like a person willing to gamble. Uh, yeah, I probably would try if I had at least some silver coins. Which I haven't. God, there's beasties everywhere. I don't like this. That's the one thing about this pack is that it's just full of danger around every corner. These one-eyed things, they just, they just run at you. Come on dudes, I'll fight you. I haven't got, oh my god, that's the ones that killed me at the start of the game. They are brutal. I ain't going near them. No way. All I want is three sheep. I don't know which way to go, I'm scared. I'm scared. 
those things are annoying because the, sh the sh like shoot projectile purple weird things at you. There's bolts here, they don't look very nice. But the sheep round out as well. Oh my god, what to do? What to do? I've got the weird point set anyway, so if I do get into a bit of bother, I can just teleport home. Collect these mushrooms, cost a handy for food. Hillsides, that's where you normally find sheep. But I've just got a sneaky thing, I'm not going to find a single sheep. I think I'm going to have to head off home soon anyway because I'm fairly low on health, on food even. So I saw something through here, I don't know what it was. Cows. Where there's cows. Where there's cows, there's not sheep. Thought there might have been sheep around here as well. Well, I suppose on the plus side, I've got food. So. I've got plenty of food even. What are those? Hello? Are you good? Sound very strange. I'm not even got a chance hitting one. Because no my luck. If I hit one, it'll turn into some sort of weird nasty creature. I'll leave you alone, I've got plenty of food for now. This looks like a good spot for sheep. What kind of hell? What is that white thing? Oh, it's, it's nothing. I got to see some more of them, three different them ones. Hmm. Ah. Whoa! What is that? Uh, I'm not going near that. I don't know what the hell that is, but I'll tell you what, I'm going to zoom home now because I'm low on food and I need to get them cooking. I don't know what that dude was. Uh, it's not even shown on the map. Should I dare go near him? Tell you what guys, we'll chance it. Let's go. I'll tell you what I might do. I think I'll waypoint this place. Um, we'll call it wild. And we'll zoom home. Get rid of my valuables. It's turning night time anyway, so good job I've come home. I'm not going home at night time. Definitely not. Alright, we'll get some we'll get some food cooked. And stay there. And uh, we'll get back cooked as well. I'll tell you what we do need. We need some more. Some more chests. Six. 
what the heck should that have that I'll, as you see that'll go about halfway. That'll boost that some more. steel dust and that'll give us more cables um, so I'm seeing that I think we'll place the first one up there maybe so we'll need to run it past yeah all through for the cables Turbine about that down there. So we've got a bit more space. And we'll put the turbine right there. Doesn't that just look beautiful? Absolutely gorgeous bit of machinery. And if we get the cables, we'll start. First, mm -hmm. shot in the head, bang, and that'll give you steel ingots, and then you obviously you do what I was going to do originally, um, but with steel ingots instead. Need some food before I forget. I tend to do that. That'll do. And that'll give you the cables. I think you get eight cables for one set. So this will give me mathematics wise, crap at it, 24. So that's quite a lot for now. Well, at least I'm, I might as well get them now and then at least there. Come on, come on, come on. Theory, I'm not even going to need this anymore. It's dead anyway, so I'll just I can stop that. I can put that to one side. Right, do this again. Three in the middle. And voila, 24 cables. And as you can see at the minute, it's got 11.71. So once we put this through. Like so, it's instantly instant power, so that's awesome. So, there we go. Um, unfortunately, guys, it is the end of the episode. Uh, so, there we go. We've got our first bit of power, absolutely awesome. We're gonna have to mine some of that out so we'll get more space for some, a couple of more windmills. We need about, I think, four should probably suffice, give us more than enough what we need. Um, I'll try and get some more things for next episode to build some more machines and hollow this out a bit more So it'll make a bigger space make it a little bit more homely And we'll do something further down here as well And maybe just maybe I'll build you the things to so we can check those dinos out But I think we'll need a space for that first so we might leave those for another episode But yeah, hope you've enjoyed this guys I certainly have. It's looking, it's it's picking up fairly, fairly slowly, but we're getting there. We're getting there. Uh, yeah, as always, guys, hit that like button if you've enjoyed this episode. Very much appreciated. 
and uh, yeah hope to see you for the next episode guys so bye for now bye